today's edition of This Week at Creek, we figure that it would be appropriate to show some love to those who are usually behind the scenes by letting them host this week. Now, making their on-camera debuts, here's Joshua and Harry. Well, can't say we didn't try. Good morning, Cougars. Welcome to This Week at Creek. I'm your host, Donovan Hanson. And I'm Gretchen Neruzzi. Please stand for your warning pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. And now for a moment of silence. If you're interested in computer programming, enjoy building things, and like coming up with inventive solutions to challenges, Robotics Club is looking for you. The Robotics Club first meeting will be held Monday, October 19th in room 2451. Teachers, speech and debate needs your help for their tournament at Creek on November 20th and 21st. Please sign up to volunteer as a judge and contact Mr. Powers for more information. Speech and debate will also be competing in another tournament tomorrow and on Sunday at Langham Creek, so wish them luck. Recently, Ms. Barnes was one of the five teachers chosen for classroom champs presented by Kroger and the Houston Dynamos. She will be honored before the Houston Dynamo game on October 18th. Way to make Side Creek proud, Ms. Barnes. If you are interested in trying out for Silverados, there is a mandatory meeting on Tuesday, October 27th at 6.30 p.m. in LGI 2. You and one parent must attend. Come by room 1820 for a tryout application. Hi, I'm Eric Eastab. And I'm Chloe Trejo. And here's your week in Side Creek Sports. The Side Creek Cougar football team defeated Jersey Village 42-37. The Cougars' pink out game is tomorrow night against Side Springs at 6 p.m. The Cougars need your support. Girls basketball tryouts will be held on October 24th at 8 a.m. An updated physical is required to try out. For any other questions, please ask Coach A, Coach Bailey, or Coach Junwick. The coaches would like to honor our first six-week scholar-athletes. Junior Megan Zubrivel from Varsity and freshman Courtney Hughes from the freshman basketball team. Great job, Lady Cougars. You make girls basketball proud. Cy Creek Bowling Tryouts for boys and girls team are on October 20th from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. at Copperfield Bowl. Please contact John Henthorn if you have any questions or need any information. Thanks for watching This Week in Cy Creek Sports. I'm Eric Eastep. And I'm Chloe Trejo. Now back to the show. What you read? The dictionary, but it has a lame meaning. Sucks for you, because I'm reading the newest version of the yearbook. The yearbook? No way. Yes, yeah, the yearbook, and if you purchase now, it's only $75, and you get an additional 30 bands. That's amazing. And you get a tissue. A tissue? Ah, ah, ah. Not yet. Purchase. Purchase. For more information about the yearbook, contact Ms. Barry or visit her in room 1446. $30,000 in tissues sold separately. So recently I've had this problem. Uh, people have been mistaking me for a girl and it's been creating some pretty awkward situations. Hey girl, uh, did you transfer from heaven? Because you're the only 10 I see. Dude, are you talking to me? Ugh, Donovan! Dude, that's the third time this week! Ugh, so I'm sorry, I have a thing for blondes. Yeah, so, uh, I needed to do something. Just grow a beard! What? Yeah, like, beards make everyone look more like a guy. I mean, some of the most manliest people in history have had epic beards. Wait, but I can't, no, can't tell you. Yeah, look at all these guys. Dallas Keuchel, James Harden, Uncle Sai. Heck, even the Emperor from Mulan had an epic beard, and he was, like, the manliest dude in the whole movie. Okay, I, I, I'll give a shot. So I decided to grow a beard. Hey Donovan. What? Outside? <sighs> oh! 
Oh my god! What? Dude, what's that on your face? It's a beard! Dude, that's not a beard, it's clearly fake, and it doesn't even match the color of your hair! Oh god, I got bleach in my car! What? So, yeah, I really, uh, I really don't know what to do at this point. Maybe I could, maybe I could shave my head or something. Son, you know they say when you put a seashell to your ear, you can hear the ocean. No, son. No, you can't. Do you have what it takes to be Mr. Side Creek? Well, the annual pageant to find our holiday hunk will be on Friday, December 11th in the auditorium. The pageant is open to junior and senior boys, and they will be strutting their stuff in formal wear and swimwear, along with showcasing the entertainment value and the talent portion of the show. Please come by room 1820 to pick up an application. Thank you for watching This Week at Creek. I'm Donovan Hanson. And I'm Gretchen Rosie. See you next week, Creek.